welcome to Odisha Post Live. This is Baishaki. Let's take a look at today's headlines. Flight services from Utkela Airport in Kalahandi District will begin August 31st. Chief Minister Naveen Patnaik will inaugurate the airstrip in virtual presence of Union Civil Aviation Minister. The first flight will depart from Bhuvneshwar to Utkela at 10.35 am on that day. An under-trial prisoner who was lodged in Bonai Special Sub-Jail in connection with a murder case in 2020 allegedly died after a brief illness. The deceased prisoner was identified as Sukram Munda, a resident of Langalkata village under Kamarposh Balang Police Limits in Sundargarh district. A scuffle broke out between the BJP and BJD workers ahead of 5T Secretary VK Pandyan's visit to the Digapandi area in Gajapati district Sunday. As per reports, more than 50 BJP workers were staging a protest at Punjikaya Square against Pandyan's visit, while some BJD workers reached the spot and tried to prevent it. Subsequently, a scuffle broke out between the workers of both parties for nearly 30 minutes in presence of police, leaving several injured in the clash. As many as five members of a family, including two women, were injured in an attack over a property dispute in Ranipur village in Bhadrak district. They have been hospitalized. The victims were attacked while returning from police station after lodging a case over the dispute. Tufan Patra, a constable posted at Tihindi police station, was found dead at his official quarters in Bhadrak district Sunday. The deceased was a native of Keonjar district. Prima facie, it appears that he ended his life using a sari, although the exact reason behind him taking the extreme step is yet to be ascertained. The walls of several metro stations across Delhi were found defaced with pro-Khalistan and anti-PM graffiti ahead of the G20 summit scheduled for September 8 to 10, police said Sunday. Slogans such as Delhi Banega Khalistan and Khalistan Referendum Zindabad were found spread on the walls. The accused also mentioned the name of Six for Justice along with the slogans. Tripta Tyagi, the accused teacher who appeared in a viral video recorded at a school in Muzaffar Nagar in Uttar Pradesh instructing students to slap a student from a minority community, downplayed the incident Sunday, labeling it a minor issue despite the registration of a case against her. In defense of her actions, Tripta Tyagi said that she was not ashamed of her actions. Prime Minister Narendra Modi Sunday called for a global framework on cryptocurrencies and ethical usage of artificial intelligence. Addressing the B20 summit in India 2023, he called for focusing on supply chain, resilience and sustainability. In an explosion at a firecracker factory, at least seven people were killed and several others were injured in West Bengal's Jagannathpur Sunday morning. The illegal factory where the incident took place falls under the jurisdiction of the Dattapukur police station in the North 24 Parganas district. Russia's investigative committee Sunday informed that Wagner chief Yevgeny Prigozhin was killed in a plane crash. The committee said in a statement that after forensic testing, all 10 bodies recovered at the site of the crash were identified and their identities confirmed to the manifest. Russia's Civil Aviation Authority earlier this week said Prigozhin along with some of his top lieutenants were on the list of those on board the plane that crashed. Wednesday. That's all for the headlines. Stay tuned to Orissa Post Live for more such updates.